What's going on guys? Welcome back to another My Faction video. Today we're gonna be going over the new Rey Mysterio card, man. I'm super excited for this, man. Hit that like button, subscribe to Jax Gaming if you guys are new. I post all the My Faction content you guys need, alongside all the big games, Call of Duty and stuff like that. I got you guys covered with all the fun stuff. And if you guys missed yesterday's video, make sure you guys check it out, man. Literally, these packs, man, a lot of people were not happy about these packs with the rewards and just the collector's rewards and stuff like that. And I completely feel you especially with the prices man i mean hey it's crazy how expensive these prices are getting and i already told you guys that it's gonna get more expensive you know we still have more tiers we still have diamond pink diamond and galaxy opal it's still gonna get crazy and i hope that with galaxy opal tier we do not have any more superstar series one cards i hope they don't i mean by galaxy opal they might have superstar series two packs so who knows what they might do so hopefully they don't have any more of those these cards because it's, it's just been crazy with the odds man but that was just today's video make sure you guys check that out man i did a little pack opening and uh <laughs> you, you don't want to miss the reaction from yesterday's video so check that one out tomorrow we do have a new live event featuring andre the giant and that's going to be really cool. Um, I actually do plan on going for this one as well. Trying to get a free pack for the punches and promos. And alongside 15 tokens, I'll definitely go for that. And we'll also be going for that Dominic Mysterio card as well tomorrow. So that's going to be a lot of fun. So make sure you guys st stay tuned to the channel for tomorrow. Because I will be going over Dominic Mysterio in tomorrow's video. But today is all about Rey Mysterio, man. We need this card unlocked. We got Rey Mysterio, the Superstar Series 1 card. So, let's just go ahead and do it, man. Alright, let's go ahead and do this. So, luckily, it's only a Ruby Batista, so that should be pretty cool. Rey Mysterio does have a fun moveset, but the thing is, is that when I'm talking about Proving Grounds, I don't really like to use High Flyers for Proving Grounds, especially with their objectives. I mean, their objectives isn't anything difficult, but it's kind of tedious. I'm not going to lie. And I would much rather use a Striker or a Heavyweight versus... Uh, a high flyer, you know, and technician because that's very tedious as well. But we only need 60 objective points, which shouldn't be too difficult as well. But look at that, man. And I'm pretty sure that this Rey Mysterio card is probably gonna have a kind of a different moveset than the Amethyst one. So I'm definitely looking forward to that. I'm pretty sure his moveset is gonna be super fast. So <laughs> it's gonna be a lot of fun, man. And he will make my team right away because he is an Amethyst. I'm definitely hoping we can get some other Amethyst soon. Especially from the packs. Hopefully from tomorrow's free pack. I know a lot of people are going to be lucky in tomorrow's free pack. So that should be very interesting. And we all deserve it. Because a lot of people yesterday in my video were getting some great pack luck. And then there were some people that were getting terrible pack luck like me. And I and I feel that. I totally understand that. I mean, the, the, the pulls that I got yesterday were ridiculous. Like, it doesn't even make sense. <laughs> I do want to go for my signature. But I feel like he's going to reverse it. So... Might as well wait till he gets stunned again. I, I mean, I feel like since we are using the gold, the C, I mean, because this is, so far is a very easy match. I wonder if I'm pretty good to go when it comes to being able to do my finisher and stuff without being. Let me see. Let, let's let's take the let's take the chance. Yeah, I knew it. I knew I was gonna get reversed, but that's why I went with my finisher first because I can get another right now. All right, come on, Remsterio. Come on, let's go. Let's go, Ray. See, this is crazy. Just get stunned. There you go. Finally. We have no stamina, but luckily he's stunned. Bam. Hit our signature. And then let's quickly lead that into our finisher. I don't know if it's going to get reversed, though. That's a huge risk. Uh, oh, 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 it worked. It worked. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Pin him, pin him, pin him. Perfect. Let's go. Got the win. Now, can we get Rey Mysterio on our first try? That would be amazing. That would definitely be amazing. Can we? Ah. Oh. All right, second match. I kind of want to quickly get through this. I wonder I wonder if it will reverse my signature and finisher right away. The quickest way to get him stunned is just by attacking the limbs, so like the arms and the legs. That is the, you see what I'm saying? That is like the quickest way to get anybody stunned. But the thing is that it takes a lot of stamina. Let me see. Oh, see, see, look at that. Look at that. He doesn't even know how to how to even wrestle anymore. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What? I was not trying to do that. I don't know why Ray Mysterio is having a mind of his own now. All right, perfect. Let's attack the limbs real quick. 
I'm gonna go for my signature. I don't even care. Please. Yes. Yes. Hold on. What? Oh, I have no stamina. Hurry up. Hurry up. Perfect. Bam. He's done for. Maybe I could finish the match here. No. Go, go, go. Oh my gosh. Let's just go inside. Go inside the ring. Let's just hurry up. Get our stamina back. I think we can be good to go. See, that's the, probably the safest move to do with both Rey Mysterio and Dominic Mysterio as their outside finishers and signatures because it's way quicker than their actual in-ring signature and finishers. So hopefully, can that give us the win? I feel like it's not though. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I know it wasn't. We're gonna go for it. <gasps> what? Wait, wait. Should I? I don't know. I don't know. No! I knew I shouldn't have done that. I knew I shouldn't have done that. But no problem. I'm really not tripping. Oh yeah, here we go. Here we go. I'm ready, I'm ready. Yep. There we go. Perfect. Oh my gosh, Rey Mysterio. Perfect. Maybe I can go for... Oh, really? That's fine. That's fine. I think I can hit my finisher right now. Yes, I can. Get up, though. Oh, my gosh. There you go. That, that should do it. That should do it. Perfect. One, two, and three. Let's go, Rey Mysterio. All right, let's see. Can we get him on this next one, man? This has to be it right here. Rey Mysterio. Dang it. Heat pack. I'll take it, though. I'll take the heat pack. All right, let's see what we can get on this next one. I don't think it's going to be Rey, though. I feel like I'm going to have to do all the matches. But luckily, I did not get reversed. I just did a quick signature and finisher outside the ring. Oh, we did get him. Oh, perfect. All right, I'll take it then. Let's go. All right, so since we got Rey Mysterio, hey, we're good to go, man. Here's a look at his stats one more time before we get into everything, man. Really nice stuff. Hey, I'll take it. He's definitely going to make my squad. Obviously, the badges aren't the craziest. Quick Climber is obviously very useful and stuff, especially for Faction Wars with all the ladder matches. But other than that, it's a decent card, and I feel like... Once we start getting more and more Amethyst cards, he'll probably be the first to go. But he's definitely going to be useful right now for the squad. So let's definitely go ahead and check him out. So with my new manager, the Paul Heyman card from the DLC pack, we do have Rey Mysterio at a 93 finisher, which is really cool. Movement speed at 90, man. So we definitely got him boosted up there, which is perfect as well. So I'm very excited to use this card, check him out. And definitely going to be pretty interesting to see how his moveset is because I've realized that Rey Mysterio has different versions in this game and he has different attires and stuff but his moveset is definitely different between the different uh, attires that he has so I'm pretty sure that this one's going to be kind of different and very fast so I'm definitely excited for that. Alright guys so we're in one of the newer weekly towers and here is Rey Mysterio quick super quick already man lacking his moveset already man feels really good too wow much better than that gold version of him my goodness <laughs> that gold version of him was just extremely slow but really cool so here are his taunts uh okay so far okay that's nice here's his heavy grounded attack do a couple light attacks really nice stuff getting people stunned pretty quickly too Really nice. So this is one of the newest weekly towers, so obviously I'm not going to get his signature and finisher right away. But that's all good, because I definitely want to showcase this card. And as you guys can see, he has a really good moveset. Definitely attacks the torso and the head. <laughs> yeah, the top rope moves, of course. Alright, so we got our signature and finisher. I'm going to just actually wait until I go in the ring to do it. Obviously, his outside signature and finisher... Is going to be super fast, just like Dominic Mysterio's as well. So let's go ahead and do his signature and stuff right away. Really nice. See, honestly, I will say this, though. I'm, I'm not the biggest fan of his signature and finisher when it comes to in-game. Obviously, in real life, it's obviously amazing. But in-game, it's definitely, you know, super slow when it comes to, you know, you're just trying to get in and out with everything. But overall, really nice card. This card is actually really nice. As you guys saw, that was a whole match. And we got that done within the new Weekly Tower. So yeah, hey, this is actually a pretty nice card, man. Like I said, he's definitely fun to use. I do like his moveset. He does have a great moveset, like I said. But 
I don't think I'll be using him for Proving Grounds much. I definitely prefer Strikers. So I'm definitely excited for Dominic Mysterio, guys. So make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel because I will be covering Dominic Mysterio next. And he will be a part of the squad, which I'm very excited for. But overall, he's still a really good card. I like Rey Mysterio. Let me know what you guys think about him in the comment section down below. And let me know what you guys think about Dominic Mysterio because I will be getting him. Make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching Jex Gaming. Subscribe to my second channel, Jex Kicks, as well. And I'll see you guys on the next one. I'm signing out. Peace.